Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. All right, to answer some of the questions I've been getting here concerning subtitles, um, I'm going to show you guys what I've been using lately to add subtitles to these um, reading practice videos and the level up videos. So, um, the first thing I should say is uh, before I used to use Adobe Premiere. Um, with that program, you have to put the uh, subtitles in manually, which takes a long time. So I no longer use that. Um, now I'm using a program called Media Subtitler. I was searching around on the internet <clears throat> a couple months ago, um, actually more than a couple months, so sometime last year, um, to find an easier way to add subtitles to a, a video, uh, particularly my um, Level Up video. So I found this program, or there's a video on YouTube going through it thoroughly. And uh, it's very easy to use. I'm going to show you guys how you need to use it. And um, yeah, so I've been using this every day for the reading practice videos and the level up videos. So the first thing you need to do, obviously, is download the, the, the program, uh, Media Subtitler. You can go search DivX Land Media Subtitler. Um, you should be able to find it. It's free. And then after you get that, you can take a look at it. This is how it looks. So that then uh, whatever video you wh whatever video you make make sure you save it to your desktop so for example today I made a video a reading practice video for Indonesian so I have this video here on my desktop there then you want to make sub to make subtitles you have to use notepad okay make sure it's a notepad when you make the subtitles and this is how you do it you type and then make sure when you do type, make sure you skip a space. Okay, you, you can't, it can't be like this. It can't be close together. You have to skip every line. All right, <clears throat> as you see here. <clears throat> okay, once you do that, you save it, of course. <clears throat> Excuse me. You save as, save it on your desktop. Okay, oops, uh, save, save on your desktop. And this should be here okay the next thing you want to do is open this up the media subtitler go to file um, you can go to open text or subtitle first and then look for that file that you saved that text file and it should be right here so here's mine for Indonesian and this is how it should look now it's sometimes it's a bit random you get like these letters here what you can do is just you can edit the box just delete them um, go through this make sure everything is spelled correctly uh, match it up if there's anything um, misspelled or uh, missing a line you can always edit and then another thing you should you should um, you should you, you should keep in mind is um, when you get go all the way to the end and delete the last one here see how it says it's nine o'clock you have to eat breakfast first is it's there twice so and this is always this way like every time I make my subtitles I always get this problem I'll just go all the way to the end and delete the last one okay after that after you went through this and checked and see if everything is spelled correctly and whatnot go all the way to the top highlight it and then um, oh we have to add the video okay go to file open video file and that video you saved on your desktop click on it open and there it is it'll be here and then make sure before you start adding subtitle before you even start the video go all the way to the top okay highlight that first part all right and once you're there you delete the last line go here play the video okay okay videos playing videos playing I, I pause it because I'm going to show you something once it starts you see this apply here you will be able to hit apply and then just start adding the subtitles every time you hear the line just add a subtitle so this is how you do it pelajaran kelima jam berapa ayu supri kita makan pagi di warung makan itu jam berapa sekarang wah sudah jam sebelas Kita harus pergi ke terminal bis. Ya, saya tidak mau terlambat. 
maafno na lebih baik kami berangkat sekarang. Latihan Tidak baik kalau kamu terlambat. Okay, you guys get the uh, get the concept there. So every line you hear, just tap the button. That's it. So all you need to do, just tap the button. Um, other than that, it's 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 very simple. And like I said, you can go and add. Like if you miss something, um, let's say you spell something incorrectly, you didn't catch it catch it before you start the video. You can pause the video. Um, you can go back, back it up, and then you can edit. Okay, and then start all over. Okay. So that is pretty much it. After you finish, um, oh, hold on. You know what? No, I'm not going to finish. Okay. After it's done, you're going to go here, go to File, Save As, and then it's going to ask you export subtitle file to format, sub rip, SRT. Don't change anything here. Okay. Just keep it the way it is. Press OK. I'm not going to do it because I already have it saved on the desktop. I don't want to override it. But press OK, and it's going to save as an SRT file and this is how it's going to look this file right here subtitles for Indonesian reading SRT this is how you this is how it should look after you save it okay now what do you do with this file go to YouTube okay now the video that you made it should already be uploaded I normally just upload the video first on YouTube um, and then and then start adding the subtitles just get that out the way upload it first and then start on the subtitles so you go to your page and then go to edit and once you go to edit it's going to bring you to this page here and then you want to go to captions these options above you click on captions and I already have a, I already have the captions added so you're not going to be able to see it but let's say um, let's see here I'll just do it for a second. It, it's not going to hurt anything. Okay, so if I, I'm going to remove the caption from this video. Now, you will see this. Upload caption file to transcript. Tap that. And then you find your SRT file. Mine is here. Open it up. And here, this is what you see. You don't have to change anything. Just keep it the way it is. And then upload. Like that. And there you have it. And then you play it. Go to. You're not going to be able to see it if you play it through here. But if you go to go to the original video, you'll see the subtitles. It should work. Now, sometimes you have to um, hit this down here to turn it on, but it should this should automatically be on. So that is it. That is pretty much all you need to do to make subtitles. It's very simple, and um, <laughs> it saves time. Before, like I said, I used to use Adobe, and it took so long because you have to type them out manually. Then you have to match them up correctly with the time. So with this one, you just tap the button and, you know, just move forward. That's it. So that is it. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. If you guys have any questions, any other questions regarding uh, subtitles or just anything in general, I, I do here on YouTube. Let me know and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. So thanks for viewing and uh, have fun.